everybody, welcome to Medicine Boys. Today I'll be talking about nephrons. This is the information I got from Wikipedia, so I'll be reading it out from there. A nephron, meaning kidney, is the basic structural and functional unit of the kidney. Its chief function is to regulate the concentration of water and soluble substances like sodium salts by filtering the blood reabsorbing what is needed and excreting the rest as urine. A nephron eliminates waste uh, from the body, regulates blood volume and blood pressure, controls level of electrolytes and metabolites, and regulates blood pH. Its functions are vital to life and are regulated by the endocrine system by hormones such as antidiuretic hormone, um, aldosterone, aldosterone, and parathyroid hormone. In humans, a normal kidney contains 800,000 to 1 million nephrons. So types of nephrons. Two general classes of nephrons are cortisol nephrons and juxtamedullary nephrons, both of which are classified according to the location of their associated renal cor uh, corpus corpuscle. Cortical nephrons have their renal uh, corpuscle in the superficial renal cortex, while the renal corpuscles of juxtamedullary nephrons are located near the renal medulla. The nominalecture or nomen uh, for cortical nephrons varies with some sources distinguishing between super superficial cortical nephrons and mid-cortical nephrons. Okay, so what's the anatomy? Um, each nephron is composed of an initial filtering component, the renal corpuscle, and a tubal specialized for reabsorption and secretion, the renal tubule. The renal corpuscle filters out large solutes from the blood, delivering water and small solutes to the renal tubule for modification. So what's the function? The nephron carries out nearly all of the kidney's functions. Most of these functions concern the reabsorption of sec and secretion of various solutes such as ions, example sodium, sodium um, carbohydrates, example glucose, and amino acids, ex uh, example glutamate. Uh, properties of the cell that line the nephron change dramatically along its length. Consequently, each segment of the nephron has highly specialized functions. The proximal tubule as a part of the nephron can be divided into an initial conv convolu convoluted, convoluted uh, portion and a falling straight descending portion. Fluid in the filtrate entering the proximal convoluted tubule is reabsorbed in the, into the pertubular, pertubular capillaries, including approximately two-thirds of the filtered salt and water and all filtered organic solutes, uh, primarily glucose and amino acids. Uh, the loop of Hanel, also called the nephron loop, is a U-shaped tube that extends from the proximal tubule. tubule. It consists of a descending limb and ascending limb. It begins in the cortex receiving filtrate from the proximal straight loop tubule, extends into the medulla as the descending limb, and then returns to the cortex as the ascending limb to empty into the distal convoluted, convoluted tubule. The primary role of the loop of Hanel or nephron loop is to concentrate the salt in the interstitium, uh, the tissue surrounding the loop. Thank you for listening to this podcast or video. Goodbye.